that I'm so nervous. You'll be fine, Cleo. I promise you that. You sound so excited in the car. But now that I'm here, I just feel so sick in the belly. Cleo, you're overreacting. I promise you, you'll be fine. Mr. Clarkson? Oh yes, I'm here, right here. All right, you both can come to my office now. <sighs> Cleo, breathe. You'll be fine. Come on, let's go. Okay. Okay, either of you can have a seat. I'll take the seat, since I'm kind of old. I'll set the box right here. Okay, Cleo, welcome to Victory Feist University. How are you liking it so far? Do you like the campus? Um, yeah, I mean, it's okay. It's really big. Well, our school is one of the best, so of course it's big. Yeah, I could see. I saw on the website, and it's one of the best schools. Yes, and you're really lucky because it's just only a 3% acceptance rate. On her last report, she had all A's. She'll make our school look really good. Thank you, ma'am. I try really hard. So I will give you your room key and then we can just get started. And by the way, your uniform will be mailed to your um dorm room in about two hours. Okay, thank you for the notice. Okay, so your dorm key should be here. Here it is. And by the way, parents aren't allowed on um, students' dorm rooms. Oh, why is that? Only on special occasions or emergencies. Oh, okay. So my dad can't come with me? Don't worry, honey. You'll be fine. It's okay, Cleo. You'll meet plenty of friends here. I just know it. Your dad is right. Students here are really nice. So you'll fit in just fine. Okay, I, I guess. I'll just help you with your boxes, though. What's up, guys? Oh, Mr. Names, you're right on time. I need your help, actually. Yep, what's up? Can you please carry Cleo's bags? Oh, no, no, it's, it's okay. I got it. No, honey, you're fine. Mr. Nades is really helpful. And by the way, you have to say goodbye to your dad. All right, I'll just take that from you, Cleo. Don't worry, they're in great hands. <laughs> <laughs> Here is your key, Cleo. All your stuff will be in your room, okay? So don't you worry. Okay, thank you. Oh, and I forgot to introduce myself. How silly. My name is Mrs. Sharklock. Yeah, I know. I saw it on the website. Oh, yes, yes, I know. I just meant how rude it was for me not to introduce myself. Come on, Mr. Nains, let's give these two some privacy and last goodbyes. Sure thing. Dad, I'm gonna miss you so much. Oh, me too, sweet pea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now you're making me cry. During the holidays, I will sure visit. I know you will. Now it's just gonna be me and your mother and your sister at the house. One last hug, Dad. Well, you should start heading upstairs. I think they already dropped down your stuff. See you, honey. <laughs> Oh, Dad. It's time to head upstairs. Hello? Is anyone here? But at least I made the score. <laughs> Maybe there's people over here. No, it's empty. Maybe everyone is asleep. Oh, gosh, I might have woken them up. <laughs> I'm gonna go get something to drink. I'm really thirsty. At least the kitchen is big. <laughs> uh, oh, my. Uh. Oh, uh, hi. Uh, I'm the new uh, roommate. You are? Yeah, I'm so sorry I frightened you. No, you didn't, huh? By the way, my name is Cleo Clarkson. My name is Atlas Fry. That's a really cool name. I wonder what's taking him so long. Hey, Atlas. Oh. Oh, hi, Um, my name is Cleo. You must be my other roommate. Oh yeah, I forgot we're having another roommate. Yep, that's me. I'm Miles, by the way. And I see you already met Atlas. Yeah, I kind of scared him, I think. No, no, you're fine. <laughs> Well, it was nice meeting you both. We can talk in the morning. Absolutely. You must be tired. Yeah, well, it was a 12-hour drive. See you guys in the morning. Bye, Chloe. What? Nothing. Okay. Uh, hello? Oh, hi, my name is- Shh. Oh, um, well, uh, this is kind of awkward. I said, shh. Okay, then, I'll just unpack quietly. Oh, she's kind of mean. I'll just set my key down and start unpacking. Excuse you? Huh? I said to be quiet. Oh, sorry, I was just unpacking. Well, could you unpack a little quieter? I'll try. Who are you anyways? Uh, my name is Chloe. Chloe, really? Yep, that's my name, Chloe Clarkson. How interesting. So you're my roommate, I suppose. Let's set some rules, okay? Rules? Yes, rules. Is that a problem? No, no, it's not. Rule number one. This is my side of the room, and that's your side of the room, if it isn't clear. Rule number two. Lights go off by 8 p.m. 
8 p.m. Why so early? Because I said so and I need to get my beauty sleep? Well, I don't think that's fair. Life isn't fair. Shh. Wow. Guess I'll just start unpacking. Um, Ugh, what is it now? Gosh, can you just stop being mean? Excuse me, I am not mean. You took my space. So what? Well, if you could read, it says 2A, which is mine's. And you obviously have your stuff in my space. Excuse you, don't touch my closet. And that shouldn't matter. I just like the top space better. <sighs> you can have it. I don't care. As you should. Now be quiet. Jeez. Uh, hey, I was wondering how the uniform looked You'll like. You'll see in the morning. <sighs> Excuse me. Ugh, she's so mean. Yeah, right, everyone is nice at this school. I really miss my dad. Maybe I should just call him. Dad, yeah, I'm fine. I really miss you. Well, I miss you too. You like your roommate? Uh, if I say no, then he'll worry about me. And I don't want him to worry about me. Yeah, Dad, my roommate is really nice. I'm glad to hear that. See, everything is working out fine. Yeah, everything is working out just fine. Did you get your uniform yet? No, not yet. They're gonna mail it soon, though. All right, Chloe, I'll call you in the morning. I'm busy on the road. You have a good night, sweetheart. You too, Dad. <sighs> Oh, you're a redhead. Is that a problem? No, I didn't say it was. I just didn't expect it. It's nice, isn't it? Can you go put my towel on the shelf, please? Really? Uh, since you said please, I'll consider it. Wait, is that my towel? Uh, I think you used the wrong towel. What? You're kidding, right? I mean, we both have pink towels. Oh my god, I think I'm about to vomit. It's not that serious. Of course it is, I used your towel. <sighs> I'll calm down. Too much stress is not good for me. I'm going to bed. Uh, good night. Good night? This isn't a good night. <laughs> okay then. I'll just close the blinds. Uh, tomorrow's a new day. Maybe everything will be okay then. I shouldn't just jump to conclusions just because of one girl. Everything will be just fine. I hope.